Hi there, it's Mike from Wondershare Recovery and welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you're looking for solutions on how to fix this error code in Windows 10, then you've clicked on the right video. Before we begin explaining everything you need to know about this error, make sure to click that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any more informative videos like this. Without wasting any time, let's jump straight into the topic. The Windows 10 error code is usually a sign of missing updates or defective boot sector. Usually it means that you have a corrupted boot configuration data. So what causes this error code? This error code mostly occurs when you try to boot up into Windows or after cloning your system image. You face this error either when the boot configuration data goes missing, misconfigured or corrupted. There are several reasons why defects occur in the boot configuration data. This could be due to a power outage, disk write errors, viruses in the boot sector or errors confronted when configuring the boot configuration data manually. With that in mind, are you ready to figure out how to fix this error code? There are several solutions to fixing the Windows 10 error code. The first solution is to check the connections to physical devices. Even though this solution is quite simple, people often tend to forget about this. You have to check if any other devices are connected to your computer when it boots as this can cause the error code. This is due to the possibility of any external devices having a higher boot priority than the hard disk. In this case, your PC will prioritize booting into the external device than to the drive that operates your operating system. Consider checking these external devices like CDs, DVDs, USB storage devices, and pen drives. You can try to remove and unplug all the peripheral devices that you've connected to your computer. Also, restart your PC a few times and look for any changes. If this doesn't solve your problem, don't worry because we've got a whole bunch of solutions, so keep watching. The boot configuration data or BCD file contains the parameters for boot configuration. These parameters indicate how to boot your Windows operating system. Thus, a corrupt BCD file will pose a problem on your PC leading to this error. To rebuild your BCD file, you need to create a bootable media from your ISO insert it into your Windows 10 computer and follow these steps. First of all, you need to access system settings from your boot screen. And for that, you can either use any Windows bootable USB to use the option repair your computer, or you can use keys like escape or F8 to access these settings. Once you reach that screen, you'll need to click on troubleshoot to access the further settings. On the next screen, you will need to use the command prompt option as this will allow you to enter commands to repair this error. The command prompt will appear and enter this command and press enter to see the options that are available for this tool. There are four parameters available for this tool. Fix MBR, fix boot, scan OS and rebuild BCD. Each of them can help you solve different boot problems. Enter each command in sequence and this will now fix your hard drive and boot configuration issues. Exit the screen and try to restart your computer and hopefully you'll be able to see that your issue has been fixed and you'll be able to log into your computer with no issues. Besides that, you can give Windows built-in automatic repair tool a try to fix the error code. Windows has a built-in automatic repair tool that can be used to fix Windows errors. You can access this utility from the settings menu or using an install USB stick or disk and fix the error with these steps. Go to the search box and type in settings. Tap on the settings option and then here choose update and security option. Tap recovery on the left hand side. Here you'll see two options for recovery on the right hand side. The first one is reset this PC and the second one is advanced startup. You have to click on restart now under advanced startup. Now your PC will restart and you'll see some options to choose the next process. Tap on the troubleshoot option. Again, you'll see a couple of options for troubleshoot. Tap on the advanced option. 
Next, click on Startup Repair option to start the automatic repairing of Windows 10. Now you will see your PC will start to repair automatically. After the repairing process, just click Continue to exit out of Windows 10. This will now restart your PC and you'll be able to access your new Windows 10 after it's repaired. Besides this, this error could also occur from a misconfiguration of the BIOS. You can use and check the BIOS settings to resolve it. Restart your computer and wait for the manufacturer's logo to show up. Then to access the BIOS settings, either use the keys F2, F12, delete, escape, or whichever one works according to your manufacturer. Use the arrow keys on the keyboard to navigate the options in the BIOS. Find the default option of the BIOS setup. Click on this option and press the enter button on your key to reset the BIOS configuration. Just click save and exit the BIOS and your device will automatically restart. If none of these methods fix the problem, then the last option would be to reinstall Windows 10. A fresh Windows installation can solve errors like these when you cannot troubleshoot it any further. Reinstalling Windows will delete everything. This means that you need to recover your important data before doing any Windows reinstallation. There are many ways to recover your data, but here we highly recommend you use Recover It Data Recovery. The steps on how to use this software to back up your data will be explained in the next section, so stick around. Here's how to reinstall Windows using a created bootable USB drive. Boot your computer from a bootable drive and click Next on the first page that appears. Now now select Install Now. Click here to indicate that you do not have a product key since you are doing a reinstallation and not a fresh activation. Choose your OS and select Next to move on to accept the license terms. Again, tap Next and select Custom Install Windows Only Advanced and continue. If you have several partitions, make sure to delete them by selecting the drives and selecting Delete to remove the partitions. Select the empty partition that you have left and choose next. Once the Windows reinstallation is finished, you can create a new user account and do a setup that suits your requirements. If you have lost data or have any unsaved data that you cannot access due to the error code, we recommend using Wondershare Recover It as it can recover files from an inaccessible hard drive with its simple to use interface. Also, it supports over 1000 file formats, which means you'll be able to retrieve all of your data easily. So let's show you how to get this done. First of all, install Wondershare Recover It on your PC and launch the software to initiate the data recovery process. Now select the location of the hard drive that you want to recover files from and click Next. Recover It will start scanning the selected hard drive for all the files. This process will usually take a few minutes depending on the size of the hard drive. Just be patient as the bigger the drive, the longer you have to wait. After the scanning process completes, select the files that you want to retrieve and click Recover. You can also tap the Preview button to check the preview of each file before recovering it. That's it, you have recovered your lost data with these very easy steps. If your Windows 10 has been plagued with this error code, hopefully you have come to the right place to fix this issue. For your lost and unsaved data, please think Recover It Data Recovery to retrieve your files. I hope that you found this video helpful. Please comment down below and let us know your thoughts and click that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.